here today with a very special guest. Yes, this beautiful bottle of mead. Yes, so we are very excited. This is very exclusive to us. Um, a fan actually made this and gifted it to us and we're very excited about it. It is called Dice Crazy Mead is their company name. And um, it's a strawberry banana shortbread. Yes, yeah, so very interested in trying that. I believe the um, specific name of this flavor is called Strength Check. As I'm sure you can tell, there is a D&D &D theme that has inspired this line of meads. So if you don't know what mead is already, it is fermented honey and water. Um, sometimes people will use fruits and other flavorings to give it a little extra something. It also usually has a pretty high alcohol content, so if you want to get the dungeon party lit, this is the way to do it. Yeah. We are just going to go ahead and get right to it. Not trying to beat around the bush today. <laughs> so, let's talk right. to it. This bottle is beautiful, by the way. Yes, it's very, <laughs> it's, it's very large. We have yes. a, a great selection here. <laughs> yes. We did try to chill this just a little bit, yes. um, just because, you know, things usually taste better chilled. I'm not going to get too crazy on the first round here, just kind of pour enough for a little tasting. Yes. Don't want to get too lit too fast. Yeah. Oh, spill it in. Oh. All right. So we decided to kind of split this up into a couple different uh, steps. So first we're going to do the smell test, I guess yes. you would call it. Very aromatic. Very, mm, <laughs> very robust. It is very robust, I don't Yes, no, it does smell very strong. Right mm -hmm. off the date, I can just smell alcohol. Yeah, like, definitely. I can definitely smell the honey in it. Um, yeah, it definitely smells like it's fermented. Like, it doesn't smell like vodka. Like, it's not nasty alcohol smell. And they said they put a uh, graham cracker flavoring into this specific batch. And you can definitely smell that. It's it smells yeah. like a candle. It's beautiful. It actually kind of smells like a wine. <laughs> I can't. I can't think of what one, but it smells yeah. like a familiar wine. It does. Okay. All right. So we're just gonna we're gonna go ahead and do the thing. Yeah. Yeah. Let's, let's try it. Okay. Bottoms up. Mmm. Okay. All right. It definitely tastes like a dessert. Yeah. It tastes. It's very sweet. It's very smooth. Yeah. Very, very smooth. Um, I can taste the graham cracker. I can kind of get that like yeah. sweet graham crackery, cinnamon -y. I don't know how yeah. to describe that flavor. It's definitely very complimentary to like the short taste that they were going to. Yeah, yeah. I definitely feel like that was a nice touch on it. I do get a small hint of the banana. Yeah, I can taste the banana. It's kind of like an aftertaste, but. Mm -hmm. The strawberry you can definitely taste like when you're very first tasting. Yeah, it's good. I agree. Oh, this is good. Very potent. Though. Yeah. <laughs> um, I already feel it burning my esophagus. Yeah, as soon as um, I hit my tongue, I was like, Whew. yeah, it's just like warm in here now. I'm very hot. It's fine. Um, they did warn us though that it was something that will slowly creep up on you. So I'm kind of wondering when this is going to officially set in. But I can, I can already feel it. Yeah, I'm already like, <laughs> woo, woo, woo. Lightweights now? I don't know. Probably. We don't. <laughs> we don't drink all the time. No. So I mean, is... you you probably don't think that because <laughs> we periodically post videos of us drinking, but it's not all the time. We yeah. Start. No. No. It's only when we do videos. Aren't you guys lucky? <laughs> so we just want to take a second and talk about what mead would pair with. Mm -hmm. So cheese, of course. Cheese and wine is always life. <laughs> yeah, so mead is definitely also going to go with cheese. <laughs> yes. Um, also, they say that the sweeter it is, the better it is with desserts. So we're just gonna go ahead and pull these snacks out of thin air. Mm -hmm. Got it already. We have cheese from Aldi, crackers from Aldi, and pinguinos. Hey. So this is a nice little sample platter just to get an idea of what might pair well with this uh, this nice little mead. Andrea, no! <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna dig in. I'm actually really hungry. Yeah, so Just get a little piece of this. This is habanero Ooh. jack cheese. It smells very spicy. It's, you're right, it does. It's my favorite. Mmm. 
Mm -hmm. Actually, <laughs> not too bad of a combo. No, it's not. Okay, so <laughs> cheese and crackers was definitely a go. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Yes. So definitely time to give the penguin nose a try. Why not? So these are the new cookies. All right. Oh. <laughs> I expected it to be soft. I know. The originals are. They're like a hostess cupcake, but mm -hmm. it was more like an Oreo, but stuffed. Okay. Very sweet, but delicious. It's a lot. Yeah. But definitely would pair well with the sweet little mead. Yeah, so it's just. So, we're super excited because not only is this delicious, but we also get to try two more that are coming up in the future. Roll for Initiative and Counter Charm. Those. Yes. So yeah, one of them is supposed to be like blueberry pancake. I'm so. excited. Yes. So with all that being said, remember to drink responsibly and never split the party. As always, goodbyes are bittersweet. So see, see you next time. time.